Howdy folks. Welcome to the R. Weaver Apiaries in Navasota. I'm Clint Weaver, the bee man of Texas. We're about to install a package right quick. Got my smoker smoking. Got my bees over here. Let's play with some bees. smoker smoking. Not working bees with a smoker, you're probably getting stung. And getting stung isn't a lot of fun. Unless you're a crazy person. Can y'all tell this is take two? Alright, got my bees here in a recycled package. Got a spray bottle. Give them a little shot. Bees love sweet water. Get my hat on backwards. All right, what I've got going on here, got my bottom board. I'm gonna put an excluder on, on my bottom board to keep my queen from swarming off on me. Old swarm catcher taught me that trick. And I thought, hey, why not? Since I've done that, I haven't had a queen fly off on me since. All righty, put my back box on there. I've removed half the frames. I'm gonna end up setting the the package cage down in the box. Got that, got this. Got my smoker smoke. There's already some bees in there from last take. All right. How the heck do we get this queen out of this cage with this can in the way? It's real easy. Simply pick up the cage, grab it like so, Secure the tail, the queen cage is on this tail. Secure that tail with your index finger. Flip it over. Get the can in your fingertips. Flip it back over. Pull the can out. No. Oh. Sometimes it's easy, sometimes it's not. Get that can out of there. Reintroduce your ladies to the sweet, sweet water. Pull the cage out. Now there is some queen candy here. Where that queen is. There's usually a cork under the queen cake, under the queen candy. I already popped it out. I like to run a little hole through the queen candy so they can release the queen a little quicker. I'm going to set the queen cage between two, two frames like this. Get my little trusty staple gun. Secure it to the top bar. Now, this is my way of doing it. Y'all don't have to do this if you don't want to. This is just a real easy, stress-free way to install a package. Take the cage, simply set it in there. Now, we want some bees on that queen cage to take care of the queen, the feeder, groomer. So. Instead of dumping, instead of dumping a bunch of bees on there and getting them flying around all crazy like, I'm going to scoop a few bees out with my hive tool, let them run over the queen cage. Come on, baby girls. Like that. One big old scoop will help, but the more the merrier. I mean, you could even just take the cage and dump a few bees on queen cage like that but you get a lot of fly around we want as many bees in that package in this box we don't want them all flying around all willy-nilly like queen's in bees are in cork is pulled now we're going to shut it down i'm 
going to put my feeder in. Feeding is very important, especially in this early stage, especially if you're installing your package on foundation. They need a lot of sugar to make a lot of wax to build a lot of cone. I'm gonna block off the entrance for a 24 hour period. Get my feeder going in there. Get your little self in there. All right. Wham, bammy, who's your mammy? That's how you install a package here at the R. Weaver Apiaries. Thanks.